And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It's Accrington Stanley up against Portsmouth. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Sean Wally. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. A chance maybe from the wide position. He got in the way of that cross. And cleared away over the byline and a corner kick to come. Short corner, let's see. Sean Raggett. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Wally. Really vital interception. Bishop. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Ethan Hamilton. Blow has it. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And over it comes. And the penalty has been given here. This to open the scoring here. And the penalty is converted. A goal is his. And now he can exhale. Well, here we can see it again. Keeper's gone the wrong way. And it makes for a fairly easy finish in the end. That's how to take a spot kick. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Owen Dale. Colby Bishop. Oh, skipping away. And he's missed it. Good heavens. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser. Bad pass. Well, 
the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. That is that for the first half here. This man will get... Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, he's admonished him rather than cautioning him. Well, spot on from the referee. He's made it clear. Another foul and he will get a yellow card. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, let's see about the cross. And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Ethan Hamilton, Harvey Rogers, Hamilton, low. And well, they're moving the ball neatly enough, just looking for that decisive pass. Now we're into the final half hour. Owen Dale. Just the challenge that was required. And a Portsmouth throw in here. And the substitution will occur now. Decent position. A bit sloppy in possession. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Sean Wally. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Owen Dale. He's going forward well here. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Hamilton. McConville. Colby Bishop. Very quick thinking there. Well, not long left now, but this crowd have been brilliant. Can the players get a winner here? Ten minutes to go. Lowry on the attack. Is this to be late drama? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Must take the lead here. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Hamilton. 
Joe Pritchard. McConville. Now he must favour the cross. Can he put them in front? He does! And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Well underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. The referee blows for full time, it ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Yes Derek, well it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. Well he put in a 